good day to everybody it's a little bit dark where i am because it's very very early but we're just going to go with our video because it doesn't matter the the time of day i think the word of god is perfect at any time and i know all of you who are on this journey with me you would agree with me welcome into our broadcast today of you are enough and i'm your host nikki if this is your first time tuning in to our channel, we want to thank you for being here. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel, like and share. Hit the like button for us and jump over to Instagram at Nikki G. McCray. Give us your support over here. If you are listening at this video right now, no matter where, where you are, it doesn't matter what part of the world that you're from. It doesn't, doesn't matter your ethnicity, your background. You were meant to see it. God is letting you know that it is time because now you are finally ready to receive, to gain, to have, and to experience everything heaven has already had for you. You are finally ready. So many of you have gone through life, you felt detached. Even in a group of people, even in the midst of people, you've always felt as if you didn't fit in. Your spirit, your soul has been restless. You've been trying to find your way. And along your way, you've been distracted. Because you're chosen and the enemy always wanted to come and take you off of your path. But it is time now. All of the things you've gone through with. The sleepless nights that you've had. Those restless nights that you've had. The tears you have cried. All of the stresses that you face, all of the challenges that you have faced, all of these things God used to get you in a place where you were dissatisfied and where you were so you can hunger and thirst for more. You never fit in. When you were little, you never fit in. And you thought that was something wrong with you because people made you believe and feel as if something was wrong with you. You were called to a greater purpose. You were called to a higher purpose in this world. And the enemy sent you distractions along the way to get you off of your bearing, to get you off of course. This is why you've experienced everything up until this point that you've gone through with since you were little up until now. But it is time. God has been leading you on your path. And he's been right there with you. You've been feeling alone, but you're not alone. You may feel lonely, but you're not alone because God promised you. He promised me. He said, I will never leave you. He said, I will never forsake you. Doesn't matter how lonely that you feel. God is right there with you. He is in the midst with you. He's right there with you. He's carrying you, family. It's time now. It's finally time for you to get it. God is in agreement. It is finally time for you to get and to receive and to have and to experience everything that heaven has for you right here on earth. You feel like an outcast. You feel like you were the black sheep of your family, but you were very special. And God marked you. He stamped you and he approved you. Your destiny has been calling you. Your purpose and your assignment from heaven has been calling you. God has been wooing you in. And he used all these hardships and all these challenges to help you get to that place. You thought it was going to destroy you, didn't, but it didn't. You thought it was going to take you out. It wasn't. You thought you were weak, didn't you? But no, all these things came to show you how strong and resilient that you really are. You got to embrace it. Don't despise it. Embrace where you are. Embrace these things that you face. You didn't go through it for anything. You didn't go through it just to go through with it. You didn't. You have purpose. And you have an assignment that you have to meet. And God is telling you that it is time. You made a decision when God started showing you signs and when God started showing you synchronicities, when God started giving you confirmation with all these things, you began to go within and you began to receive the person that you know you've always been. You've always thought different. 
you've always had a different outlook on life than everybody else. And people made you feel like something was wrong with you. No, you were special. You are special. You are peculiar. You are a royal priesthood and you're from a chosen generation. But it is your time now. It's finally, finally your time. It is. And you know it. You can feel it. Your spirit is bearing witness of all these things. Everything that you thought was going to take you out and destroy you, this is what is being used to elevate your life and to promote you and to put your life on a positive trajectory. The trajectory of your life will change from this day forward. The trajectory of your life will never be the same. It'll never be the same. And you, you will never be the same. You won't. What you thought was going to destroy you, yes, you. Those of you who are listening, God is going to use that thing to make you. You've been made. You have been made. You know who you are. You know what your purpose is. Now it's time for you to walk in it. You're getting ready to fulfill. You're getting ready to have a better life. You're getting ready to have opportunities. You know the doors that were shut in your face that you thought you were supposed to go in. You weren't supposed to go in that door. The opportunities that you thought you were supposed to have and it was given to somebody else, how you were overlooked, the position was overlooked, that promotion, they, they overlooked you and gave, you to some, gave it to somebody else. God allowed it to be because it wasn't for you. If you had have taken it, it would have set you back. And you would have had so much burden with that. God has better for you. So the doors that God closed, thank God that they're closed because God knows what's best for you. God will open a better door for every door that was slammed in your face. For every promise that people made to you that they broke, God has a better opportunity to give you. For every opportunity that you thought you missed, God said you didn't miss it. The best opportunities you're getting ready to experience. Because God said it's finally time now. The lessons and the tests you've learned, you understand more now. And now the signs and the synchronicities, the confirmation is all around you. God is saying, now you are ready. Now I'm ready to release what's in my hand to give you. Because now you have positioned who you are. You got to come to a point in life where you trust when it don't look like it's going to come together. You got to believe when life has given you every reason not to believe and to doubt. You got to believe because you got to know who your faith and belief is in. Not in people, not in things. Your faith is in God and God will never fail you. I don't care how hard it gets, how tough it gets. It doesn't matter who left you, who walk away and leave you. It doesn't matter who broke the promise to you. It doesn't matter who overlook you, who forsook you. All of these things don't matter. God has factored all these things in and he's going to turn them around and he's going to make it good for you. You already know this. You felt this. You felt this. You sensed it. You have. And I'm just your confirmation. You've always been different. And it's good to be different. The world's supposed to see you different because you're peculiar. Nothing wrong with being peculiar. That means you're different. You are a light family and you got to embrace your light. Don't hide your light. Put your light on a hill so the world can see it. Because people who are walking in darkness, it is the light that they see in you that's going to cause our life to change. You've got, undergone a great transformation and you've undergone a great transformation because it is time for you to walk in your purpose. While you were born, it's time for you to walk into that and fulfill it. Your purpose is time for you to walk in it and fulfill it. Your kingdom assignment, it is time for you to get busy, walk in it, and fulfill it. It is finally time now. It is. You're finally ready. You're ready now. You are. Everything that you've gone through with family, these were nothing but mere distractions. Nothing but distractions. Some of the relationships that you were in that you wanted to work so bad, God said, no, I'm not going to allow it to work because this is not the person for you. I know you wanted 
to be. But God said, no, it can't be because the heart is not good in this person. They're not who you think they are. The friend that you thought would be best friends forever. God said, no, there are parts of this person that you don't know yet that you're going to discover. You've had all of these testimonies. You had all these challenges. You faced all of these things. These were nothing but tests. These were lessons that you were supposed to learn from because this is what's changing the trajectory of your life. Hardships, struggles, pain, challenges, challenges. These things make us, they don't destroy us. They make you. Now you have a confidence in yourself that you didn't think you would ever have. What you thought was going to destroy you and literally kill you and take you out. No, this has lit a fire up under you. Now you are running and you're not going to look back. Run and don't look back. Hashtag that run and don't look back. You have nothing to look back to. You have everything to look forward to. You do. You are already there. You got to receive it. You don't have to try to make it happen for you it's already done hashtag that it is already done it's already done it's already done it's your time it's finally your time now family now you get it now you get it you really get life all those things that used to matter to you it don't matter to you anymore now you get it you know change is intrinsic Transformation is intrinsic. It, beling, it it starts, it begins on the inside of you, not on the outside. Everything that you're seeking is within you. Go within, not without. Change is not external. Change and transformation, it comes within. I'm proud of every one of you. I know you face hardship, challenges. I know you were in some things in your life that you thought you were never going to get out. And I know you almost lost your faith. I know you did. But when we begin to lose faith, that means we've keeping, we've taken our eyes off of the Lord. Just like Peter, when he asked the Lord, forbid me to come. And Jesus said, come. And he began to walk on the water. And when he took his eyes off of Jesus, and when he began to focus on the storm and the wind and the waves and the roar of the wind, he began to sink. Don't look at any of these things externally in life because it's going to cause you to sink. It's going to take your faith. Keep your eyes on God and you're going to keep going up from there. Thank you for tuning in to our broadcast today. Don't get scammed on our channel, family. Everything you need to know about me is in the description box of our videos. We love you so much. Hang in there, family. It's time now. It's finally time. Now you get it. You get it. And I'm your confirmation. God bless you. Talk later. Bye-bye.